Hey guys, as the title suggests, in this video I will explain in further depth and nuance what's expected of you in the final reflection essay. And that essay asks you to metacognate, to reflect. Now, all of the uh, post rights that we did for Brooks or Culture Analysis were kind of SFDs and practice and preamble for this essay. Um, this prompt mentions that the thesis must have a metaphor. My growth as a writer can be described as blank because blank. Now the reason I do a metaphor is it forces you to be analytical. You can't just summarize your growth as a writer. I learned how to write my Brooks essay. I learned what AEE was. I learned what a thesis was. It's robotic and dry. The metaphor forces you to give me whys and hows. Why and how is your writing like blah? Why and how is your writing like blah? Right? It forces you to be analytical and really explore yourself and metacognate. This is still an assignment that is designed to help you grow and learn. It's about the learning, not the earning. What I'm looking for is that you can show me that you've mastered the global issues of writing, focus, organization, development support, and ethos. You can really identify in an essay that every sentence has a job and this is how they relate, and then you can metacognate and reflect on your growth as a writer. So I hope that all makes sense to you. I look forward to reading all of the collection essays or some of my favorite essays all quarter. If you have any other questions, please don't uh, be afraid to use the course Q&A forum or shoot me an email. All right, guys, have a good day. Thanks.